in Zululand in South Africa. I made some fast friends at the watering hole. Welcome. I'm Caroline. Oh, Welcome Caroline. to Tanda Safari Lodge. Gosh, this is beautiful. And to quench our thirst, yummy drinks as we arrived at Tanda Nature Reserve where we had a sizable welcome. This is unbelievable, Pierre. You don't see many of these elephants with big tusks. The big tuskers are slowly disappearing from Africa, Linda, because poachers have systematically killed them, and their progeny become ultimately toothless herds. We are so blessed to have a bull with such big tusks and to have him so close up at the lodge. We're in their natural habitat. We elevate it so he's not threatened. We're not in his space. But beyond this watering hole, they're very threatened. Private reserves like Tanda take significant steps to help endangered animals in the wild, including ones who like to cha-cha with our vehicle. And there's such a small footprint of development and yet such a huge expanse of land. And that's what makes it very unique. So guests have an opportunity to really enjoy the wilderness and touch base with being out here close to nature, close to the animals, and also being able to reconnect with their souls. Life as we know it, it's an intrusion of every possible bit of electronic that buzzes in our ears from phones, iPads, computers, televisions. You can't connect when there's distractions. You can't focus. You can't even focus on a relationship when there's distractions. It's being able to connect with something that's been here for generations. And generations of Zulu women in colorful dresses connected me to their song. But what we're trying to do is to expose guests to Zulu culture. It, it's something you can't experience anywhere else in the world. And see kicks like this. Ian had a go. Tanda means love. You come to Tanda and it's all love that you're going to feel. I'm tapping in